Nice. Every cloud has a silver lining. Never mind the weather. We got a lot of things to worry about. Why don't you look what it is? Excuse me. Look what I've got, Mr. Louis. Come on. Come on up, Snoops. And I got something for you, Bull Goldfish. Look, put him right here, Mr. Hornsby. About eight in there, I think. Come on, I need her back like that. I am dying, and she's bringing the animals. Did you see the papers? Yes, I saw the headlines. It says that certain party is stuttering. And every time he's stuttering, I am tittering. Oh, did something happen to your hotel, Mr. Louis? No, if he's in the soup, the Hotel Louis is blowing. Oh, who's in the soup? The certain party that give you the sables. What sables? My dear young lady, we're all along. Will you please cut the tragedy? But I haven't got any sables. I am trying to give you my friendship. And she plays poos around the corner. What is this? A horse? No, Smarty, it's Kalinsky. Me and you both. Well, if you don't believe me, ask, ask uh, Mr. Van Buren. <clears throat> well, if it's uh, just the same to you, I'd rather remain on the sidelines. He's the one who told me. Well, if, if, if this is Sable, he, he must have made a mistake. You, 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 you wouldn't give a Sable coat to a stranger, would you? Uh, who, me? Never. Ah! Uh, what, what was the name of the gentleman that helped you order my supper last night? Too far is enough. The imperial suit for one buck a day with breakfast, one egg, I don't mention. The bottle of wool in 1919, Guinea pigs, hunky dory. But when you tell me that you don't even know the name of J.B. Ball, my dear young. Do you mean to tell me that, 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 that old gentleman is J.B. Ball? Mm -hmm. And you thought I took a sable coat from him? Mm -hmm. Come on, Snoopy! Mm. Come on, Mr. Hornby! Get out of here! Put that back on the icebox. Such a humiliation. Oh.